What's up guys, it's Bruno and thank you for joining me on today's awesome journey. Uh, we are gonna be talking about intermittent fasting. Intermittent fasting sounds like this really complicated, complex, like gotta be toughest of the tough to do it, but that's not true. Intermittent fasting is for you. Intermittent fasting is for everyone. Now, people have been questioning on social media, Snapchat, Twitter, uh, hey Bruno, what, 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 what's your new diet? What's your new workout plan? Because I've been working out for a few years now, but I am just now getting into the best shape of my life. In the past two months of me intermittent fasting, I have lost over eight to 10 pounds of body fat alone. I've noticed the lines on my body becoming more defined. I've no noticed my muscles look bigger. I feel better. My body feels better. I'm eating better. I'm having a much better experience with life than I was before. Intermittent fasting works, and now I was already in pretty decent shape, but starting this intermittent fasting has taken it to a whole new level. Like, I feel like I could be a real model. Um, what is intermittent fasting, Bruno? Well, there are multiple different forms of intermittent fasting. I'm gonna to talk to you about the eight slash 16 hour intermittent fasting. So basically what it is, um, is you can eat within eight hours of the day and the other 16 hours of the day, you're fasting. Um, this is important because uh, during those 16 hours of fasting, roughly around the 12 to 16 hours is where your body is going to, to burn more fat and more calories. It's also going to increase your noradrenaline hormones, which also produce, um, which are also hormones that help produce weight loss. Studies have shown that doing intermittent fasting will help you lose anywhere from three to 8% of your body weight by the end of 24 weeks. Now that is a substantial amount of body weight that you can lose. Um, one of the great things about intermittent fasting is not only does it make you eat less calories during the day overall, it's also going to help you burn more calories. So you're um, putting less calories in your body while also burning more calories out of your body. It's like the perfect combination. Um, for me, intermittent fasting looks like I wake up around eight, nine o'clock. Uh, I'll have, you know, some coffee or a Red Bull or something if I want, or just drink water and stay hydrated, and I won't eat until about 1 p.m. If I get super hungry, yes, there are times where I might have like a uh, protein isolate drink or a, anything low calorie, but still gives me a little bit of protein, um, but that's only on the days where I'm really feeling hungry. I promise you, intermittent fasting is not that hard, especially when you're doing the eight slash 16 hour fasting. You know, eight hours on, 16 hours off. And the best thing about those 16 hours is that you are asleep for eight of them. Like, how great is that? Intermittent fasting makes it sound like it's gonna be hard, um, but I noticed a big change in my body. I noticed my abs were more defined. I noticed that I felt better. I noticed that um, all the goals that I've been reaching and working hard for the last four years or so, diet was the key thing that I was missing. And yes, my diet has been great over the past year, but when I had just started doing this intermittent fasting is when I really noticed my body was like, but I am, we are going to slim down real fast. You wanna lose some weight, uh, you, wanna, you wanna have the body that you feel comfortable with, the body that you want. It doesn't have to be all muscled up or all thin. It just has to be what your goals are. Intermittent fasting is gonna help you reach your weight loss goals. Even if it's just um, eight to 10 pounds that you wanna lose, intermittent fasting is gonna help you do that. Um, intermittent fasting does work really well with those who wanna work out too, um, but if you're less of a gym person, intermittent fasting will help you keep off the calories that are going to build weight on your body. So long story short, you should try intermittent fasting. Do some research about it, see if it's something you can do. I think it's relatively easy, especially once you've gotten into a routine of doing it. I mean, it automatically puts all of your calories of the day within these eight hours, and then the other 16 hours, your body's working off those calories, burning them, lowering your insulin levels, increasing some of your growth hormone levels, and overall giving your body the chance it needs to recover and build up. Um, some people think that they're going to lose muscle mass doing this, you're not. You're not. I feel stronger than I ever have. Like, I, I, it's weird. I don't even know how to explain it. But the research shows it, um, and my experience has shown it. Um, and I'm sure those of you who follow me on social media have seen it lately as well. Um, if you don't follow me, it's 
Ben Bruner Rose on Twitter and Instagram and LeBroser on Snapchat. So make sure to follow that. But if you don't want to see someone who's shirtless or always in their underwear, then you probably shouldn't follow me. But if you do, go for it. Um, also, <laughs> subscribe so that you can be answered to win free Calvin Klein underwear every month. What's better than free Calvin Klein underwear? Well, there's plenty of things, but it's a great thing to start. Other than that, if you feel my vibe, subscribe. Other than that, have a good night. This bed is really squeaky. Clearly it needs to be like sex proofed or something. <laughs>